Hi guys, Silverback here with a quick tutorial. Uh, now, the other day I was sent a Elgato HD60. Um, have no idea where it's come from. I uh, received it through the post. So, uh, wherever it's come from, thank you ever so much. Now, when I set this up, um, I had a few issues uh, with the actual uh, live streaming and syncing the sound. So, I was a bit... I was like, well, okay, that's not right. Um, it's playing the video, and then there was a sound delay of my actual capture card. So I really wasn't aware of what was going on. So I, I sat around trying to work out, well, how am I going to do this? So I went into settings, as we do see here. Uh, we went into general, looked at it, there was nothing there. Encoding, uh, looked at everything else, looked at the bit rate, that was fine. Went to broadcast settings. Uh, made sure they were all fine. Looked at the delay seconds there. No, that wasn't the issue. And I thought, oh, it must be the video. Um, didn't look at it. Couldn't find out what was going on. Made a few changes. Um, no, nothing at all. Then uh, looked at the audio. So, uh, no, still nothing there. And went into advanced. Now, this is where I found the issue. Um, Basically, um, a full desktop audio uh, to use a video timestamp as a basis for audio time. That's a global audio sync offset. Okay, so I put that to 1500 milliseconds. Tried that, nothing at all. So I kept it as that and I saved it. Now, the scene buffering, I, I put a 2000 um, and it, was, it wasn't going how I wanted it to go. So then I went into Elgato, I went into properties. And uh, when that comes up, I'll show you. I had a look through, um, looked at this. I changed my custom resolution to, to 1280 by 720, reduced it to 30 frames per second, made sure that the audio uh, output was to the stream only. Then I saw audio sync offset. Now, I was toying around with it. I'd put it to null, put it to 1500, but that only increased the delay. Then it clicked me. If we can go positive, surely we can go negative. So, I put it to negative 1500. Streamed, absolutely fine. There's no delay whatsoever. So, by offsetting it to 2000, okay, as well as the desktop to 1500, then you off sync the audio by minus or negative 1500 milliseconds. It actually syncs the delay. So, that is absolutely awesome. That is a, the only way you can audio sync when streaming the capture card devices audio and gameplay so you have the video and the gameplay in perfect sync so that is how you do that guys so quite simply we go into we we'll go over it again we're going to settings okay just make sure that's just going to pop onto there it, it will refresh it every time so you're going to uh, into advanced right there we do scene uh, buffering time, okay, onto there, and then we put the global off sync to 1500, okay. So that that gives that a 1500 audio second delay. So you click OK on that, then you go to Elgato on scenes, right click, click on properties, okay, and you quite simply change, click, make sure that that is uh, that is ticked there, then click audio off sync. So audio sync offset to negative 1500, okay? That will give you the perfect delay for the capture card sound to picture. So guys, thank you ever so much for tuning in. I hope this helps you uh, a fair amount. Uh, any problems, feel free to uh, write any comments below. I'd be happy to get back to you. Cheers, guys. You're absolutely awesome. And uh, we'll see you on Advanced Warfare.